I've got my losses out of the way. Hopefully I can get a solid win now and at least start this going. Uh, you take the key early on. There's a lot of things that could open it, like a lockbox. Also, anchor is good because it's worth 1.8. I actually like keeping the anchor right now. It's too early to remove the key. You kind of want to remove it right at about the time that your board is starting to fill up. Because right now, if I remove the key, it becomes an empty instead. It's a net loss. These are terrible options. Yeah, I'm thinking reroll but it hurts not having a good first uncommon. I actually kind of like Quigley. Quigley, you can actually build around. Blue Pepper is going to be out of style really f soon. I might just go Hexatidium because it's worth three. Yeah, why would I do that though? I don't like decreasing my luck odds. I think I'm going to grab it anyway. It's a little mad, I know. I'm also going to just grab a thief without an answer. I'm kind of desperate right now when it comes to trying to make something anything work. So I think it's an interesting idea to just kind of branch out a bit, try a lot of different possibilities. This is a skip though. I've been skipping Shiny Pebble a lot lately, and that's just because I feel like I haven't been noticing the 1.1x luck odds. Three capsules, huh? I need something that's worth two. <laughs> oh my god, two more capsules. This is all the capsules. Well, removal capsule is a little better. Tax evasion for the thief. I'll take it. And a thief can build up without much risk. Now I could go with the lockbox, even though I'm still kind of hurting for empties. I figure it'll take a while for the two to meet. Take a present, I guess. Dog becomes wolf. All right. Almost forgot that. I think I have an okay run going now. Dogs are great. I might actually grab another key. I could have gone red suits, just seeing how this is going. That's the thing. You can never really know what's going to happen in the future. All right. Safe for the key. Oh, wanted poster or green pepper. Green pepper is probably better. Green pepper is too good on floor 20. It's so good with duds, even with the thief. I mean, the thief will be a nice bonus. Don't get me wrong. But you, you take the consistency here. And the thing is, if I take wanted poster, we all know deep down that I'm never going to find a way to destroy the thief. So it's just better that uh, I let it be because now there's a chance I could stumble on a bounty hunter or banana peel. Any intention of playing Outer Wilds? I've played it before uh, in my own time. Played it to completion. Great game. Do highly recommend. I think I'm glad I didn't play it on YouTube. I feel like that might have hindered my enjoyment of the game. Anyway, my options are three essences that do nothing for me, huh? Don't have a monkey. I guess I take a reroll because, I mean, I could always be recepted to a five-sided die. Take a rain. And it's wanted poster again. This time I actually might grab it. Yeah, because my other options are shit. And frankly, well, if it happens, then it's really good. So wanted poster finally got its wish. It was wanted. Uh, another dog's become a wolf. I would love to see a second thief though. Oh, an apple. Hello. Am I going to make rent? Essence or hustling capsule, huh? I am 50 away from rent. I think I'm going to make rent. Isn't thief like a six per now? Um, it's a 12 per. <laughs> it, it's technically a 12 per if I can destroy it, which is a really big if. I like essence just because it, it can make a run now. I think I am. Well, here's the thing. Both of the things destroy the heat thief are common. I want banana peel. I want bounty hunter. Therefore, hexatidium isn't that bad to keep around. I think I'm just going to barely make rent, but it's going to be ugly. This is Skip City. Yeah, Zoroff is also good, but that, that's true. Zoroff is rare. I wouldn't count on him. Telescope could be really good and then just hold on to it. Yeah, this is good. You just take into disable it. Five side die is great. That's worth five for a while. I guess I take piggy bank for just a small surplus of money. I have no adjacency bonuses. Well, I have bee, flower, rain flower. I... I guess I have a lot of bees and a flower, huh? I, I suppose I could do this if I'm desperate for money. I'll consider it, actually. I think I actually want a second flower here because of all the buffers I have. I can get rid of some garbage like the coin right now. The pearl is also bad. I might have to enable telescope soon. I can't go essence capsule. It's too much a risk. 
All right, four spins to get 165-ish money. So I need over 40 per spin. Yeah, Telescope Essence is gonna have to proc. I think if I have Telescope Essence go, I don't think I'll need much more. So I think I'll skip here. I also have Piggy Bank. I have a little extra money that I'll be getting from there. 2.5 times six. And if I destroy the Thief, I for sure make it. Oh, these duds are about to go, huh? So maybe I should be taking stuff. But yeah, I'm about to enable Telescope Essence. Coconut half or milk? I'm actually gonna go coconut half here. Milk technically gives more money in the next three spins. I'm thinking about the next three spins. So I'm gonna go milk, gonna go telescope. Like if you add up the money, milk is gonna pay out better. All right, but the flowers are gonna have to hard carry here. That's a good start. Uh, urn I think is better than milk, barely. Looks like I'm gonna make rent. Well, now I almost want to turn off the telescope essence, you know? Save it for a better day. I'm thinking about three-sided die because I have reroll. I also have five-sided die. I have three empties. I can take a three-sided die. And then I will turn this off. Barely make rent. And hope I can find a really good rare because this is the time now. Uh, I don't have three cats. I don't think I'm going to get three cats. Take a dishwasher instead. Hope I make it to 18 spins. <laughs> Oh, I got Zoroff and a thief. Um, interesting. Wow, I got Zoroff. I mean, I guess you take Zoroff here. <laughs> See, part of me wants to just add more thieves on the run, but I think I should be play smart here. This is about to be the best value Zoroff ever. Looting glove for thief. Oh, ho, ho, ho. the greatest mid game thief of all time. And I'll wait for it to happen. I can let it take its time because I can let the thief build up. This thief is a an 18 per right now. Every tick it stays alive. Uh, I mean, I don't care if it destroys the hooligan. Hooligan was out halfway out the door anyway. I guess I could take bounty hunter, huh? They're both after a thief, but Zarf is also after the bounty hunter. Or I could go minor. No, I go minor. I want Zarf to hit the thief. Let the thief keep building. There it is. How much money is this? <laughs> That's an achievement! A beautiful, beautiful achievement! Wow! Talking about baller thieves. All right, I am set for the next, like, two rent cycles. Now, hopefully, I can make something of this run. The world is my oyster, and I don't know what to do with it. Like, do I take a slow coal now? I feel like that's way too slow. I'm gonna just go creature. Here's the thing, right? I'm gonna need to get rid of Zarf at some point, because I think whatever I build around it is gonna be a face. Dude, I'm getting offered so many coals. What is going on? Now I don't need to take stuff like three-sided dice. I need something more worthwhile. I mean, it could be some sort of bee flower type of run. I think a rabbit fluff. I also want to get rid of this hexatidium. Yeah, I think I could make rent. I could probably buy the place. Oil can is not bad. Clear sky, I don't have either a sun or a moon. Take oil can essence. Witch has oh do i have an apple too i have an apple a hex and a cat which is pretty good right now i could get rid of the czar off at this point purple pepper has not much synergy right now actually time machine huh is that why it offered me all these coals because it knew it was going to give me time machine of course guess i'll take brown pepper let's get rid of czar off now he's done his job i think i'm kind of building more around witch or possibly bee flower oh, i need to disable that that's gonna be too annoying robin hood huh Robin Hood eats apples. I don't like that. He does also eat thieves for what it's worth. I also have tax evasion. He is pretty good. I do admit losing the apple kind of stinks. Oh, he buffs thieves. Right, right, right. I'm going to take him. Whatever. Yep, he, he ate that apple pretty quickly. I think it's okay. It, it's something to build around. Bear is not bad. Any honey or beehive sort of thing is great already because I have bees. Yeah, this is the ultimate thief build, although that could fall off a cliff real soon. I like Hustling Capsule more than Hex of Emptiness. I don't know, though. I do have Witch. Yeah, but I don't like skipping symbols. I wouldn't mind stuff like Hex is a TDM or Hex is a Hoarding, even. But skipping symbols? No. I do need somewhere to take this build. Rares dictate a build, generally. I don't have my Hooligan anymore, so no big earn. Yeah, at least Dishwasher is going to give me a little direction. Gambler? I mean, why not? It's free money. I have two dice. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, that was quick. 
All right, still doing good on reds, but uh, yo, I'm slipping a little. Zoroff's contract, huh? A little bit late there. Quantum symbol bomb, what does that give me, huh? Well, it seems like there's some good stuff in there. Yeah, let's go Quantum. Another Robin Hood, I guess. I mean, it is pretty good from the build. I could go for some arrows, that'd be nice. Black Cat's really good since I've Witch, too. Uh, Rain Cloud's not bad either. I like Black Cat more. Feels more easily scalable. Too bad I don't get my essences until next time. Buffing Capsule is great. Unfortunately, I didn't get to buff the big um, Robin Hood. Oh, I'm actually a little behind rent right now. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Beehive. Yes. Okay. Finally, something uh, that my build likes. I got bees. I got a bear. I got a quantum symbol bomb I should take. Dog makes wolves. Those are still good. Anything good here? That's a skip. I could have taken crow. I didn't like it, though. <laughs> Frankly, I don't like any of these, huh? Yeah, this is Skip City. All right, Wealthy Capsule, cool. It's kind of a Looting Glove build. Lucky Capsule is great. More things to possibly build around. Another Beehive would be great. Emerald, huh? I don't really see the appeal of Emerald. I want to go for a little better. Cow is okay. I have Cat. Black Cat Cow is actually kind of good. It'll give 18 for each milk destroyed. That's actually better than I previously thought. That's pretty good. Yeah, Lucky Capsule for another shot at it was okay, but I like Cow here. I kind of like Bear with the Beehive. I also have one Beehive, so I might just let it rest. I'm not even making honey yet. If I have a honey problem, I'll get more bears, but I don't have a honey problem yet. All right, I am now basically out of good money. This run has sputtered. It really needs to take a turn. This run really needs to take a turn for the better. It might have to involve getting rid of the unlucky ca uh, hex. I almost said unlucky capsule. Conveyor belt is good, I think. So is rain cloud. Oh, yeah, rain cloud might be better, actually. I mean, conveyor belt has both cow and beehive synergy. Damn, okay, this is tough. Rain cloud is consistent. I have two flowers, one rain. Conveyor belt has two things. Oh no. I think conveyor belt's more fun. I just have to hope that I get five symbols added in the first place. And this is where the run can start to get good now. Rusty gear could go work on wolves. Turns them from three furs into 4.5 furs. I don't know if that gives four or five actually. It could also hit duds, which is scary. Or big symbol bomb, two removal capsules. In a deck like this, that's pretty good too. <laughs> it's a 50-50 though. What's gonna hit three of a kind first, duds or wolves, right? I could also keep it and disable it, it's true. And it's, I'm not even thinking about the risk, I'm just thinking about the upside. Is it really that good of an upside? I think I'll take it and disable it, we'll see. Oh, Quiggly the Wolf, huh? Okay, never mind. With uh, with Quiggly the Wolf, that can actually pay off now. I like a second beehive, even over Golden Egg. Some great options now. Fruit Basket or Lucky Cat, huh? Fruit Basket has nothing, so I guess I take Lucky Cat. Okay, so now I can do this until the dud pops. I will get rid of the Hexatidium in hopes I can find more good things. But yeah, wait for the uh, dud to go away. Three more spins. Dog is good. Oh, dog is really good. Hold on. Comes a wolf. I'm considering going oil can. I think I'm going to do it. Try to hit the uh, quickly stuff. Well, so that's not it. I could respin here to try to get the last one. Oh, yes. Yes. Okay, good. Good dogs. Don't need wine. And now I think I'll actually try rusty here. I got four wolves, three duds. Oh, perfect. <laughs> Excellent. I'm just thinking if I want to respin it all. Yeah, I'm just going to let it ride. All right. Wolves are looking good now. They are eight perks. Lovely. A bee is good. I have, whoa, I have three honeys all of a sudden, two beehives. Let's take another bee then. Yeah, the run took a while, but it's finally coming together. It had that weird buffer at the beginning, and now, now it's starting to pop. There we go. I could go for another bee. I could, but I don't find it that necessary. Three is enough. All right, one more thing to be created, and then I will finally have this be popped. That was a 164. Well, I, everything went off that time, huh? All right, awesome. Conveyor belt essence has been moving. Now I just want the real conveyor belt, huh? What am I getting rid of at this point? Anchor is pretty lackluster, so goodbye. Lunchbox, huh? Well, I'll take any honey as I see. I would also take a second bear at this point. Skip, see if I get anything good. Void fruit's great. 
Watermelon or void fruit? I like watermelon. It says very rare. What the hell? Okay, yeah, take the very rare thing, I suppose. Two watermelons is way better than one. Hell of a luck. This run has been a total roller coaster. Oh, popsicle. Popsicle can synergize with uh, telescope, so I can get more mileage out of that. I'll do that. A uh, third beehive. Hell yes. But the actual popsicle. W where is all this very rare stuff coming from? I can't believe it. Okay, I can't wait to enable all my essences come the final boss. And now I just skip like crazy. This is awesome. Oh, that's gonna be a good cat. Yeah, that can still pull in numbers. I'm glad I have it. I could see myself getting rid of the cow now because I only have one cat. Do I want a second bear now? There is the double eat with the bear. Oh, and beehives are going to be popping off, true. Because I have the conveyor belt thing, yeah, it makes sense to go for a second bear. It hurts not having a second removal capsule or another removal capsule because that cow needs to go. It's going to be making a lot of garbage in due time, I hope. Wolf is... What does Wolf actually become worth if I take a new one? Because it doesn't have Rusty here. Is it just the five per? I think it's, yeah, just the five per. That's still good. Yeah, this build is going incredibly now. I'd still take five furs. I mean, especially if I get a moon. It's pretty good um, turnout. Zaroff is interesting. I have a witch. Robin Hoods could go. They're not my best symbol, the Robin Hoods. Zaroff can also be a slow boy, but I'll... No, I'll, I'll enable full screen. Anyway, I go Zaroff. I thinned this out. Coin on a string can thin things. Or it can give me a little bit of extra money, huh? And let's get rid of that cow. Zaroff is back. It's like he never left, actually. I don't take things for Zaroff. Zaroff's entire purpose is to thin out the pool. Eldritch creature. That can destroy the witch, too. Well, Zaroff is already going to do it. Do I like a forper? I think my build is good enough that I don't care. Um, how it should be better than a four per, wouldn't it? It'd be a five per, six per after the witch. I guess it's a six per. Yeah, it's basically a six per. Fair enough. Yeah, I guess it'll also destroy the landlord hex. That wasn't something I was really caring about one way or another, but it is true. Yeah, six per is better than a four per. Four per, I actually would have turned down. Six per, I can handle. Cultist, do I want it to grow? I mean, it could be hit by a Zoroff too. There's two things that killed this cultist. I don't hate it. And sometimes it's the Eldritch creature. Cool. Time capsule, anything good in here? There's a few not so good things, but I think I'll take the risk. I don't think there's anything that's run losing. Got a present. That's one of the worst ones. It's just slow. I don't think I'll mind that much. I could take a toddler and try to get rid of it. Then Zoff could get rid of it. Yeah, yeah we're, we're gonna have a chase. All right, toddler. Uh, nope, never mind. Died before he could open the gift. How sad. He spawn camped the child. I mean, yeah, that's one way to look at it. He's just the professional. He does his job well. He doesn't see age. Sus. Um... Let's unmark the essences, huh? I mean, it's just going to be lucky seven. Unless I think I can get five cats. I don't think I'm getting five cats. I don't even really want one. Beastmaster, I don't think I care about. I mean, I got bee buffs, but that's not it. Let's look for a moon or another beehive. Dove is interesting. I don't think I like it that much. I could just grab another honey. Wolf buffs. Yeah, um, the issue with Beastmaster is that I have Zaroff, and I'm not, and I'm about to enable Telescope. So that's going to be very short-lived. <laughs> it's going to be extremely short-lived. Do I have any fruit basket synergy? Yeah, I have watermelons. That's pretty good. All right, so telescope up. And I will up oil can as well. So let's send it. Oh, God, I have to think about re-spinning. I don't even know what the play is here. Maybe try to get some honeys by this bee. Oh, honey by the bear. Oh, and the bees buffing everything. This is actually going to be pretty good. Yeah. Really good. Thief. With Zoroff. Yeah, I'll take that. Just like the old days. All right, the... Oh, the beehive can't make it more honey. That's sad. Show me Zoroff. Didn't get it. Yeah, this is still great. Coin gives a little bit of free money. Assuming they can still be removed. I actually didn't check 
Uh, that'd be kind of embarrassing. Zoff can destroy... Oh, both things. Good. This is two duds. Surely I can do better than this. Much better. What does the thief even give now, huh? 63! And he was barely around. That's cracked. Eh, coins can't be destroyed or removed. Remember that. Now Zoroff is kind of just on his own, isn't he? I don't think he's trying to hit much. I could reroll this column, see if I get anything good. Uh, there goes the telescope. That was fun while it lasted. Oh, the landlord is terrified. Absolutely spooked. Oh, it's the Hex of Destruction. Oh, just in time for the Eldritch creature to not be able to reach it with telescope. That's a shame. Well, this is the column I respin. <laughs> I can take another Hex of Destruction. I won't. Kill him with Piggy Bank. I don't worry, I'm planning to. I don't know if it'll work, but it's worth a shot. I think this is the worst column. Didn't get much better. Bears are pretty useless. Let's see if I can get anything good. Nope. Weakest column. Probably this one. Guess my weakest column is right here. Oh, I probably can launch Piggy Bank now, huh? Get him, Piggy! That's gotta be an achievement, right? It isn't, but it was a cool run. Okay, I have a win streak now. 